Hey everyone, this is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set your home page in WordPress. Now, this could be either a static page or by default, it is usually your latest post. So let's go ahead and see what your options are here. We'll take a look and use my WordPress website at tonyflorida.me for demonstration. And I just want to show you the home page right now. Currently, as it stands, it is pulling in my latest post. So you can see them actually twice. You have uh, some of my latest posts up here and down here. So what if we want to make this a static page? We have a page that we already created and we want that to be our home page. Let's show you how to do that. So first, let me show you uh, the home page that I created. And this is under my pages section in the WordPress admin dashboard. And I have this page uh, right here. So let's look at that. And this just looks like this um, just says, hello, I'm Tony Florida. This is where you can start on my website. You can read my blog. And then, you know, just some some other content down here. So what if I want this to be my home page? Well, if we go back to the WordPress admin dashboard and go to settings and reading, and we can change our home page display settings here. So instead of our latest posts being displayed, we can display a static page. So we'll check that radio button here. And for home page, we will pick the page that we designed. Hi, I'm Tony Florida for that. So let's save those changes. And we'll come back and take a look at post page after this. Um, but I just want to focus on the home page for now. So back, let's look at our WordPress website. So let's view the site. And now instead of seeing the, the dynamically generated page with our latest posts, we see the static page that we designed. And this is now when people go to Tony Florida, when people go to tonyflorida.me, this is the page that they'll see. So let's go back into our WordPress admin dashboard and take a look at the, the posts page because we have to specify that now if you are using the blogging capability of WordPress. So under settings and reading, um, we want to pick a post page, but we don't have one right now. So let's go ahead and create a, a posts page. And what this is, is essentially just a page that's going to be um, a container to display your latest post. So this page isn't going to have any content by default. So if we go to our pages section, add a new page, and we're just going to call whatever you want to call the blog section of your website. I'll just call it um, my blog, okay? And like I said, there's gonna be no content in here. I'll show you what that looks like in a second. So we'll publish this. And actually I wanna make this, uh, let's just call the URL blog. So people can go to tonyflorida.me slash blog. So we'll publish that. And then um, if we view that page, we'll see that there's nothing here right now. That's because we haven't associated it with our posts page. So back in the WordPress admin dashboard, we can come back into settings and reading and then pick that page, my blog for the post page. So we'll save those changes. And one last thing before we test it, I just wanna go back into our pages um, and show you what the my blog page looks like now. If we click on edit, it says you are currently editing the page that shows your latest post. So there is really no content in here to see. So back in our website, let's go ahead and test it out. This is our static home page, and I did already previously link this to go to the blog page. So when I click on read my blog, we'll be taken to a page where you can see the the latest blog posts in here. That should be about it, guys. If you have any questions about how to update your homepage on WordPress, let me know in the comments below. I have plenty of other WordPress videos here, so check those out as well. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video.